that we expected them to be. There will indeed be resolution on that mid lane on the Shadow Fiend, Silent on the Jug, and your Witch Doctor Rubik being handled by Always Want to Fly, Lower Dance, Shoku on the off lane on the Spirit Break. Rocket Barrage, Yoki's got to be careful. Back it off here. They're going to try and give him the old run down. There's going to be another Riptide here in a second. Yoki could be in a lot of trouble. There's your second Rocket Barrage, and that is going to be your first blood going the way of Artor there. And at the same time, it looks like bottom lane, Empire did find the kill onto Clockwork, but Secret peeping them to it and ensuring that they are the side that claims the first blood bonus. And it's off. Silent? Yeah, he's... Empire. And found it <laughs> and again, Yoku trying to do his best here to find the XP hey, that he can. But Kuroki and Puppy, they're ready with the wraparound. Yoku could be in trouble. He has got a charge. Puppy, he's going to be there and ready and waiting to cancel it if it comes out. I think Yoku realizes he's already dead and he certainly will go down. Arteezy there getting a second kill in this safe lane. And... <laughs> Oh, yeah, talking about the CM, very nice pick up there from Empire. They do run into Puppy at the uh, at the rune, and they might even find more as well. Charging Yoki, this is going to be big for Empire, finding two kills, and it is a double kill going the way of Resolution on the Shadow Fiend. So very nice for Empire to find the rune spot. We we'll have some uh, turnaround gold going his way, and this is a Shadow Fiend. He doesn't even need to be in the mid lane. He always has the jungle turnaround farm. Bottom lane, Maledict, it's going to be enough to Zai to pop and Empire, well they're saying, well, Secret, you might have had a good start, but we're... Serverward behind the tier 1 mid tower, and also block off the, the big camp for the... Oh, boy, Doctor, they're all rotating around onto him, there's nowhere for him to run, RTZ will be able to claim that one with the hero. Yeah, Resolution discovered that his big camp had to be either taken or blocked out by a sentry ward, and the charge he wants to do in RTZ. Yeah, the bash getting S4. The f oh, nicely done from Puppy holding by the charge, but it looks like S4. He's going to be the sacrificial lamb here as he does go down. That's going to be another kill here for your Shadow Fiend. Resolution now dominating in the mid lane. They've gone in on Zai. Has to lead things off with a Blade Fury, and I think Zai's done for. Absolutely, down. the bounces, the maledict, it's all too much for this clockwork. And at the same time, mid lane, the fights continue. <laughs> Yoku wants to try and find more here, going in onto Puppy. There's a telekinesis from Aloha Dance, the raises fly for as well. Another kill for Empire, three heroes on the sideline for Secret. Oh, it's easy, he's coming in with a cooldown. He's not going to want to chase that though, as he is all alone. And Roki, he's taking use of this free lane, he's found himself level 6 and just applying some pressure now to this tier 1. Arteezy trying to take down the tier one here in the mid lane. And there's your hook shot from Zai. Strands resolution. They've got the cooldown as well. This is a massive value kill. He's on the streak. And Arteezy will be able to end it. Gets himself the goal for that one. There will be a charge coming on to Arteezy. He's trying to find more here with the rocket barrage. Onjo Lohar does the rune. Telekinesis is not enough. He goes down. Arteezy will get a double kill. Looks like he will almost certainly pay for his life. And he does go down. Zai and S4 trying to see if they can find more. Therefore, now from always want to fight. And the cops for Zai actually already going to the death one. Zai's going to go down. The charge for Ryoki bringing S4 back. Can they find this kill? No, they can't. Yoki will go down. And now Silent, he's still got his zombie stash. Wants to fight, so he probably doesn't want to use on Puppy. Puppy looking for the Ancient Deny. S4 will get himself out of the sidelines. He does use the Omni Slash there to secure the kill. Ensure that the Deny won't be there from the Ancients. And a bit of a hectic fight there going in between. Bag themselves up. Silent still just here on the front lines. Doesn't have the Omni Slash to use. And I don't know if they can stop this. There's going to be a TP in now. Coming from the Witch Doctor. But Silent, I'd say an extra bit of a rush. And he always one of the He's got the death one. And he lays it down. That's easy. He's almost certainly going to pop. Yes, he will. That's going to be one kill. They got the flash for him as well. Bring it back here with the telekinesis. Can he get himself out? Oh, he's trying to. There's going to be a regular assault for resolution. Catching Zai here. S4 is still alive. Trying to run away. Silent moving forward. But he doesn't have the Omni Slash. We're going to see resolution trying to bring down Zai here with the raises. The dive from Empire is real. The Yoki charging forward. But Puppy is able to hold back the spear breaker. There's your Nether Strike. Onto the CM. The song comes out for Kuroki. But it's too late. The Blade Fury. It might just kill him. No. Kuroki will get out. But Empire again, this is the kind of CIS aggression that we expect from the team and it seems to be just a little bit too much for Secret. And, well, 13 to 8, let's have a look at that fiery cap. Then, well, 13 to 8, let's have a look at that fiery cap. This time, Volvo, we're on point and we can see the lead there. About a 1k in terms of gold. And oh, sorry, he's oh, hello. What is going on? He hit on? that oh. big charge. Yoki was charging the top lane and Zai just intercepted him with the hook shot. Oh, well then, that is quite... He's in a bit of trouble there. There's a charge coming through.
I think this might be the last of the CM. We'll see for a good 15 seconds or so. He's going to turn around with a freeze. He's looking for the honor, but he still gets it out, of course. And the final bash there, a bit of a BM bash from Yoku at over 6k net worth. And they might find Kuroki here. He has got the... Well, no, he's not got the Sora Sarin actually for 30 seconds. Kuroki's in a lot of trouble. Therefore, will get laid down. And that will be Yonaga Sarin falling here on the top lane to the rotation here of these two supports. And there's a charge going mid. I'm gonna follow three, but 16 to nine still, and each of these trades just bring an empire that little bit ahead. Oh, secret on bottom lane. Hello, there's your only slash is a big one. Going for Dota Tz. He's eyes there with the hook shot, holding back silent. Maybe secret can turn this one around. Is gonna be anyone else going from empire? No, because oh, that's how he wants to keep there. He wants to keep fighting as well. Yoku going straight on to Arteezy. The Rocket Barrage doing a lot of damage. Arteezy, could he get this kill? No. Arteezy will get taken down to the bash there from Yoku. Sana moving as well with a healing ward. They're trying to keep Yoku alive. Yoku's going to survive. He hides himself in the tree line. The Illusions will find him out here. He will go down. Zai, he's trying to keep himself up over the blade mail. Now it's four. Trying to clear Sana. Get the Shadow. I mean, it's going to be enough. It's not going to be enough this time. And this time, Secret taking the trade. Two for one resolution. He's got an Invis ring. Does he want to play here from Resolution? He's wearing up soon. He's got to go if he wants to go soon. Puppy going to be the one he runs into. He winds oh. up. I don't think he gets it. Double raise. Doesn't get it. Oh, the song there. Stopping the last race. Flying through. And now Resolution. I mean, it was a bit of a buzzword. He's got a lot of hard times backing him up. Going with a fade ball. Maybe they can kind of find Kuroki. Kuroki will not get away. The raise finishes him off. And now, here's our sword. He's ready to try and clean up both a low hard dance and resolution. The low hard dance will go down. Resolution trying to come through the raise on test for It's not enough. And Artor cleans up with a double kill there. And Secret, they're looking for more. Hookshot. Also, always want to fly. He's hanging around here on the sidelines in the trees. He gets a malediction and paralyzing cast count, but it's not enough. Witch Doctor to fall as well. And Secret finding three kills there on the bottom lane off the back of, well, Res Resolution. The question is, can they, they're charging in. Empire, they're going to go full deep here. They want to contest as well. The only slash flying through as well. And they're going to be caught out from Arthur Max. Oh, the death ball coming out from the silence, but the Crimson Guard is doing so much for the side of Secret. Both Sina and Yoku getting loaded. Do brings out Arteezy, but it looks like S4 with the Quill Sprays. It should be enough to find Yoku and Sina as well. Sina trying to deal with the flashes as well from Roshan and helping out. Sina will fall as a double kill here for S4. Buybacks coming out from both Kuroki and Arteezy. Two heroes falling on the side of Empire and Resolution. Oh, he's got to be careful. The drums are popped by Arteezy. There's going to be the net as well. Missile flying forward as well. Onto the Shadow Fiend. He's got the mech, but he doesn't have a BKB. He tries to get out the Requiem, but the missile comes in just in time. Now he gets out the mech. The Death Requiem as well will fly through, but that is going to be three heroes down on the side of Empire. Secret did use two buybacks, and oh, Zai does get taken down here by the uh, the combination of Aloha Dance and always want to fly. But Secret will be the ones to find Roshan. They will get the Aegis to set something up with this Invis rune usage now. Of course, the side of Empire, they do know that he's popped it. Always want to fly. He might be in trouble. He's going to pop the cast down to losers. S4 with the wraparound. Puppy's there as well. There's no effort for this man to fly. He gets out of the maledict, but it's not going to do anything. There's going to be a telekinesis from Aloha Dance trying to save the Witch Doctor, but the quill sprays are too much as S4 is able to take that kill for himself. Sign up with a Shadow Blade. Maybe thinking about going on to Zai, but there's no mini stun. There's no mini stun, my friend. And Zai will be able to TP away from that Omni Slap. Might see some kickoff. Telekinesis onto S4. Oh, 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 here we go, Kuroki setting it up with a song. The cooldown comes out onto the wall. They're going to pop the mech, trying to keep themselves alive here. Don't the stop. stolen soul from Aloha Dance, saving the side of Empire, enabling them to get themselves back out to the high ground. It looks like Always Wanna Fly might be the only one to drop it. But that, oh, maybe they can turn it around. Yoki charging board onto Arteezy. The Death Force they can, it will get cancelled straight away. They do lose the Witch Doctor. Everyone else, the, oh, oh, the cheeky. Telekinesis down to the bottom lane from Zai. Can they finish him off? He passed the blade mail though. And there's going to be the death strike coming through. The resolution trying to do the damage. It will be able to bring down Poppy here. Letting it go from the high ground. Yoku charging forward. Able to cancel that one here. Silent with the blade fury. Trying to bring down Arteezy, but he's just too tanky. S4 just going in. Going ham with the quill sprays. They've taken down two. It's a two for one trade at the end of the day. And even with what looked like a very nice song steal into a into a defensive maneuver, I mean, I, but it, they, they just can't do it against Secret's lineup with the items that they've got. Yeah, S4 oh. is just too strong right now. They're not down. They've had kind of low on the cooldown. And Yoki even charged into it. And with that, I think he's going to go down. That's more of an eight because he's designed to die here. And he's not even dying. Oh, the Omni Sash wow. comes through. We'll get to pick that up was some RNG. 
That was some serious RNG yeah. through through the Creekway killing off Asura and Silent now. A little more keeping him alive, luckily, because Espo wants to chase to bring him down. Espo may still do so. Oh boy, Empire just getting walloped in their own face now. Yeah, and with that mech, S4 is not even going to lose the Aegis. Yes, it's oh, 24 to 23 now. Each other, it feels like Secret have enough options to just play around the BKB of the Shadow Team while the same cannot Ooh. be said the other Poppy. way. Uh, he's going to back himself away. He just forced off himself out as well. There'll be a charge flying through from Yoku Empire. They're all smoked up. They want to find a fight here, and this will be a very nice fight if they can take it. He's going to cancel the charge. They doesn't fancy diving the tower. In fact, he's going to let Silence do that, going straight onto Puppy. They should be able to bring down the CM. No, he's going to hide into the trees. Now the TP's going to bring the song as well. It's going to get canceled straight away because Puppy, he's only come from the battle for Glenn Fury and Valtteri's going in. The stolen song with the death ward onto Valtteri. He's bringing him along the bashes as well for the nether strike. They take down the Jarakopter. Now here comes the Recreate on top of S4, the Ugly Slash as well flying through. The Guardian Greaves that has popped by Kuroki, S4 trying to back up into the tree line. Zai, he's got the Blade Mailer, but it is going to be enough. Empire to try to go down the clock by S4. He's on a godlike streak though, as he does take down Yoku. But Empire, they want to die for this one. They want to find S4 in the tree line, and they almost certainly will do. There's three, four of them here. They'll take down S4 as well. And what a fight for Empire, taking three of the heroes down. They do lose two, but that will maybe hang on. Hang on, Secret aren't happy with this trade. They want to make it better for themselves. They're going to find always want to fly. Can they find anything more here? And look, Kroki, who wants to go for more? Cops will be stolen by Lyra. Does get popped down. Kroki's got enough mana here for a net. But now Kroki, maybe he's been off more than he could shoot. He'll fall as well. And the fight, it continues to go on. We're sitting 27 to 27. Oh, oh, Zai, can he find this kill? Can he really find the kill onto Silent? He's got a four star. He's got a battery soul. No one else is there. Oh, the double cogs. Cogs on cogs. The cog blocking is real. Zai ends up getting four star down to the river. Will back himself away, but... Because oh, he took a so much damage during the BKB. As the song set up, it's only going to be on to always want to fly here though. If they can find this, do Empire want to try and fight this? They're just going to let this one go. They're still going to let this one go. Zai actually hook shotting straight forward onto Resolution. Manages to force himself out away from the center of that Requiem. And Resolution will simply TP half the net. Fly through just a little bit too late. But Secret are able to find themselves a kill there. And uh, Empire don't get anything. The main other thing, like, down to eight seconds now, but I uh, saw at least uh, seem fairly healthy. Zai going to catch up to Yoki here, and Yoki trapped at the top of the blade belt. Clockwork get both blade belt up, but it's going to be Zai who gets the worst end of that one. Dyer's top tower is and in the low hard dance. Oh, he's trapped up here by the nets. They're going to send the illusions through. Now, this is a bit of a rough point for Empire. There's two here, but as a secret, they're just standing on the high ground and chip away this tier three. Silent, maybe thinking about going in, but the physical damage here just going through the Blade Fury. Bring it down to half health. And now there's the charge for Yoku. They want to go to RTZ first. Out comes your cask here. And Lara does wait for something good to steal. And oh, the song is going to keep RTZ alive just. He should be able to get himself out of the Guardian Greaves. Now the call down coming down to resolution. Well, Lara does. What's he stolen? No, he hasn't managed to find it. There's going to be a hook shot onto your Rubik. Zai going in with the Blade Man. They're looking for the cage match. Silent trying to make out with the Blade Fury. They're going to lose a low hard dance on the Rubik. They're not getting like charge for Yoku. Going straight forward. It's onto the illusions though. And RTZ will drop, but he's got the Aegis here. He's ready for round two. A puppy with a freezing field. It's going to be a double kill for Arteezy as Resolution will fall. And this is two heroes all down on the side of Empire without buyback. This will be the middle back. It's almost suddenly going down. There's a fortification available. But with these two heroes down, Empire, they're going to have a hard job holding back the aggression of Secret. And this will still hold on to his BKB throughout all of this as well. And that is a big problem. They just do not have a way to prevent this melee racks going down. No buybacks. But they're trying to beat all the Rubik, and this is a Rubik with a lot of farm. They've really invested Radiance quite heavily. Radiance middle barracks. Yeah, and see, they're going to look for a second set here, silent. Still on the front, but with the Omni Slash already used, and oh, cheeky four stuff. Always on a fly stick to miss off the face, puppy. Yeah, Silas gonna get some hands that one off. And now the Rocket Rise coming through as well. Asphalt thrown down the boost. Did he get Telekinesis down? Wolf Rabbi thrown down to the side. Yoki charging straight for onto the CM, but Kuroki, he's there with the net. They're trying to bring down the Spirit Breaker, and they certainly will. That's gonna be the Spirit Breaker going down. And now it looks like they might lose more. Arteezy moving forward here with the BKB. He wants to try and find this Witch Doctor Silent, and now Resolution TP in. With the raises on to S4, so if ever the damage in S4 will have to back himself away with the rest of the team. 
But everyone keeping themselves alive here. Kuroki just setting in the illusions, whittling away at this tier three. And secret, they want more on Sly. Oak shots in onto the hard dust. The mech comes out for resolution. It's not enough to save the Rubik. Your Rubik will go down. Resolution lives for the Requiem. It will catch them here with the damage reduction, but the damage itself, not enough really to bring Esther a side of secret down that much. And the tier three will almost certainly fall here. Maybe the Rex as well again. Empire in a position where there are two heroes down. Silent even just denying that tie here because he realizes he's gone all. Oh. There we go. Sonta, I put the call there. What's a three? That's Cox as well from Zan. Beyond the English move them out. But resolution goes down. They've lost always one of five. Zan and two want to get out. Yoko coming through secret. They're all incredibly low. Zai's pot, Kuroki. They might lose out easy as well. No, the Shadow Blades could allow it to get out. Now Yoko signs are actually cleaning up here very nicely. Three heroes down on the side of secret. They're going to lose Poppy as well. Almost certainly no. Forced to the low ground. The charge is there though. He's not getting out of this one. CM will fall. It's a double kill for Silent. And the side of Empire, they don't lose the top set of racks here. And they're able to... The pings are coming out though. The side of Empire, they're going to smoke straight past them. And they're going to the base, there's like, well, where's Empire? And Empire's like, well, we're not at home at the moment, I'm afraid. You have to leave a message after the tone. They are outside here by the river. They're going to look for the wraparound, and it looks like we're going to see a smoke on smoke coming from the backside. Silent onto Puppy, they bring down the CM. But now the song is going to buy them some time here. But, oh, are they going to be able to do anything, though? The song's actually meaning this BKB from Arteezy is kind of useless. And now the death board here coming down onto Zai. That's going to be your clock way down. Secret, they've lost two. They're going to lose three as well as S4 falls as well. Empire once again catching Secret off. Guard and secret just they're just falling apart this part of the game again another fight where the gold is the strap oh It means the Jug, the Shadow Fiend are getting a lot done. They're, they're just wreaking havoc. Even Yoku on the Spirit Break is stunning a ton of heroes. He died so many times this game on Spirit Breaker. But he's getting so much damage done. Cheeky. Oh. Just pressuring it right now. Dyer's top tower is under attack. Radiant's middle tower is under attack. Dyer's top tower has fallen. Dyer's top barracks are under attack. Dyer's top barracks are under attack. Secret, I think, realizing they're in such a desperate position, they just... I think they saved the song. I think it wasn't even defensible.
Dan GG call Akhirnya tiba-tiba gue yang ngangat nih GG call ini Dan congratulations buat tim Empire Berhasil mengambil satu angka Dan kita akan lanjut ke game keempat Apakah tim Empire bisa memenangkan game keempat Memaksa Secret buat bermain ke game kelima Dan di game kelima apakah tim Empire Bisa kembali untuk That memenangkan Pertandingan kali ini stay tuned